Hello YouTube. Well, I'm back on the uh, ER5. It's uh, been off the road for a few weeks because I uh, had a little mishap which I uh, talked about in the previous vlog whereby I had uh, knocked it over my driveway and uh, bent the uh, handlebars a little bit so uh, I couldn't be asked to do it myself so I've uh, been into the garage and uh, they fixed it so I've uh, just got it fixed up today so uh, it's looking pretty good um, one thing I wanted to uh, talk to you about was uh, something that um, came up in a hangout in fact it's come out on a few hangouts uh, I don't know if any of you guys watch uh, Mr. and Mrs. B's Brain Dump hang out on a Thursday night uh, which I've uh, taken part in on many occasions um, now a few times uh, there's a vlogger that comes on called uh, Beast Rider who's from uh, New York and uh, one of the things that uh, Mr B asked the panel is uh, if we've got any sort of news and topics and uh, he almost always comes up with the, uh, the same same question, much to uh, our amusement, and that's uh, whether we've uh, changed our vlogging style since we started vlogging. Uh, I'm not sure about my vlogging style, I mean that's for other people to determine or not, but one thing that definitely has changed is uh, how, uh, how confident I've become since I've, you know, not only started vlogging, but uh, since I started riding a bike. Um, I've only actually been riding a bike for just over four years. Um, I got my bike license in February 2011. Um, didn't come from a biking family at all. In fact, uh, I think the only person I can remember ever having a bike of any sort was my uh, grandfather. And that was many, many years ago. I think he had a scooter. Other than that, no one in my family ever rode a bike, but I, I just decided one day uh, to get one, having gone through a bit of a dark period in my life whereby I was getting divorced and um, I just wanted to do something that was completely different from something I've ever done before, so that's why I decided to um, get a bike and I never really looked back really, and uh, I remember when I first passed my test I didn't know anybody with a bike and therefore didn't really have any friends with bikes which was a bit sad I know but um, and then I kind of watched a, quite a few videos on YouTube I remember watching them as I was doing the training uh, but it didn't didn't occur till much later I would say probably a year after I a year or two after I passed my test I, I decided I was going to I was going to give it a go and I have to say I haven't looked back since I've made so many friends in this community it's just utterly utterly amazing and I've you know I've met so many different people um, and people and friends that I've made that you know I wouldn't ordinarily have, have made if I hadn't um, started riding a bike or even began to vlog so um, I'm really internally grateful really for the uh, the opportunity that's kind of opened up for me um, so I thought I'd just kind of share that really so just you know thank everyone that I've either met face to face on ride outs um, talked to and been part of on hangouts and and those of you that perhaps I haven't met but have kind of communicated uh, with you over the internet you know on my videos etc so um, you know a big thank you for for everyone making me feel really really welcome in this community and, and opening my life up really um, to a whole new range of friends that I didn't uh, didn't have before so uh, thank you very much guys so yeah I think that, that kind of will do for today's vlog just wanted to kind of chuck that out there and uh, as always take it easy guys ride safe and I'll catch you next time.